guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. My name is Anna and today I have another seller's haul for you guys. And as you guys can tell, we have so many beautiful goodies. A lot of these items are straight actually from Brazil, some from Mexico, and you guys, they are stunning. So as I mentioned before, if you guys actually watch my personal haul, you guys know that I'm really getting into free forms. So you guys, I have a ton of new free forms for you guys and i'm so excited because i waited till i got all the different ones in so i can offer them to you guys all at one time so let's get started because i have so many new goodies to show you guys so the first thing i want to show you guys is i did restock up on blue onyx again so i had these way back when when i got my brazil order with pink amethyst like a while ago a few months ago and you guys sold me out of these so quick so i got new ones i got some smaller towers so they're not as expensive the first round of these that i did get i got the big chunky towers so those were obviously a lot more expensive so those are going to be definitely more on the affordable side for you guys and with those towers i also did get some more citrine towers in for you guys now you guys look at these beautiful towers i want to say mostly all of them have really nice beautiful gorgeous rainbows in them they're a really nice champagne color of course they range in color right like this one is a little bit lighter this one is a little bit darker but nevertheless so gorgeous this one even has a rainbow up top really really gorgeous high quality citrine towers i actually haven't had towers in a long time and ones that are so like nice and clear i also haven't had in a really long time the last time i got towers they were more on like the smoky side and weren't as transparent so these are really really gorgeous and nice gemmy quality citrine oh so so beautiful and of course with the towers I did get some more free forms for you guys because I know a lot of you guys loved the first round of citrine free forms. So I got a lot more for you guys, of course. So let me show you guys this one. This is actually the biggest one that I have. And you guys, I just want to show you all these gorgeous inclusions in this one. They are so amazing. It has so many rainbows. It really is so gorgeous. I feel like the light might be blocking out some of it i'm trying my best to really show you guys as well as i can but it has really nice rainbows really beautiful inclusions and it honestly is such a stunning piece now the first round that i had before there were more smaller and medium sizes so this round i definitely have a lot more bigger ones because i know in the first round that's what a lot of people asked me for they asked if i can actually get some bigger ones so you guys know I listen, I hear to what you guys say, so obviously I did get some bigger ones for you guys. But don't worry because I do have the medium and small ones because I am mindful of budgets. And again, a lot of these have really gorgeous rainbows in them. I am absolutely obsessed. They are so stunning and I'm so excited because I got a different variety of free forms for you guys. Now they are from Brazil, but I did place a few orders so it took a while for me to get them. But I'm so excited that I finally did. So I also got some beautiful Brazilian fluorite freeforms. And you guys, I mean, just look at these. You guys know Brazilian fluorite is really, really gorgeous. I had towers way back when. Again, when I did my previous Brazil order, I had a lot of towers. But this time they had some freeforms and I was getting the citrine freeforms. So I was like, you know what? Give me the fluorites as well. So, so gorgeous. I really love this big one. It has a really nice variety of color and really nice banding. So you can really see the color even better. I also did get some really beautiful rose quartz free forms as well. Some different qualities, some more gemmier, some lesser qualities with a lot more white inclusions. So you guys will have some different options and different price points as well. You guys know that I really try to be mindful of these and I'm just honestly so obsessed with these free forms. I feel like everyone is really gravitating towards them. I'm obsessed with them. I'm really in love with them. So I really try to get 
different type like all the different type of crystals that i could in these free forms forms amethyst ones so some will be on the more darker purple side some on the lighter purple side some have inclusions some don't but that's what i really love about these free forms is that they really are unique because the sizes and the way they're carved are so unique and so different that's why i'm really really obsessed with them i actually display all of my free forms currently like all together and you guys i kid you not it looks so so cool and then the next thing i want to show you guys is i also did get some flower agate ones and you guys how stunning are these again i am just i'm obsessed i really cannot talk these up enough i really really love them and really tried to find them in all the different crystals that i could and i've actually seen some newer shapes of the free like newer crystals i'm sorry not shapes i've seen newer crystals so i've seen like strawberry quartz i've seen smokies i've seen clear quartz in this free form form so i'm definitely going to try to get those into the shop as well you guys i am not kidding you when i say i'm obsessed they are really really gorgeous and any type of free form that my vendor had i was like show me i need it give me it and then here are some really smaller nice little like nugget free forms of the flower agate now again as i mentioned i have them in all sizes so you will see really big pieces more medium pieces some really nice smaller pieces again i do want to make sure that I get a good variety and a good amount of sizes for every price point that I possibly could find. And then also from Brazil, I did restock up on beautiful Monet Jasper as well as some pink amethyst hearts as you guys see right here. Now you guys, I'm obsessed. Monet Jasper is really, really gorgeous. I mean, you guys, look at how beautiful they are. They range in color from these beautiful beiges to these blues and pinks and browns. And they really are just really, really gorgeous. This one is actually really special because it's polished on one side, but it's matte on the other side. And I never saw something like that before. Like, that's really, really cool to me. But I just thought, oh, I needed to get these hearts. And also, someone actually did ask me for hearts when I did have the first round of towers in. They did ask if I can get some hearts. I actually did stock up on some more towers as well. But I did get some more hearts because they are just again really really gorgeous and here's another one with some brown some purple some pinks some blues it's just oh jasper also is really another one of those crystals that really really has my heart like anything jasper i'm obsessed with and the fact that there's such a variety of different jaspers that you can get is like so crazy it's honestly so crazy to me i think i've already gotten at least 20 different jaspers in the shop and there's still more that i haven't gotten now this is a beautiful pink amethyst heart you guys really really love pink amethyst i love pink amethyst these are really really gorgeous a lot of them are more like brown pink colors but really really nice so really subtle pink colors with a lot of nice variety and definition and i am absolutely obsessed and as i mentioned i did get some bigger ones i also got some smaller ones as well now these what i really love about these smaller ones is usually pink amethyst is on the more expensive side no matter what you buy hearts slabs spheres it is pretty pricey so the fact that i was able to snag like a lot of these smaller hearts is really really awesome because i am not going to price these up like a ridiculous price like these are not going to be anything more than about 20 25 dollars because it just it doesn't make sense right it's a nice small heart so i'm really glad that i got these because usually when you see pink amethyst it is on the more expensive side it does get pricey and i want you guys to know as well that pink amethyst even for us is expensive even at wholesale prices it can get pretty pricey especially things like spheres and things like that those can get really really expensive so i'm so glad that i found smaller versions because they are obviously more affordable and will be more for like the more affordable price point compared to the bigger ones so then the next thing i want to show you guys is i actually also got these beautiful mexican fluorite slabs and you guys obsessed you know my favorites are amethyst like my top three are amethyst fluorite pink amethyst so you know i had to include some beautiful fluorites in here but look at how gorgeous this is these are really really nice because you can even use this as like a little jewelry dish even though it's not a dish it is a slab it's so beautiful and transparent that you can almost like put your perfumes on it put any type of jewelry pieces on it and it's really going to stand out and make it kind of like you know a really nice statement piece in your home i know a lot of people use it that way 
And what's really great is that they are really universal, so you can use them for a lot of different things. They don't just have to be something that you display. And then also those black stands that it comes on will come with each piece, so don't worry about it. You will get the piece to kind of be able to stand it up and display it. I will give you those as just kind of a freebies for these beautiful slabs. They honestly are so gorgeous. I cannot talk up Mexican fluorite enough. If you guys have bought Mexican fluorite for me, you know exactly what I mean. It's just these really beautiful pastels, greens, blues, and purples. Honestly, it's so much more stunning in person. And I would say if you're someone that does not have a Mexican fluorite in your collection, you need a Mexican flora in your collection. I totally understand if you don't want to splurge on like a big slab like that. That makes sense to me. But I will say if you can, try to find some Mexican flora because it really is absolutely gorgeous. And then the next thing I got, which I thought was really, really unique and I haven't seen before, are these beautiful smoky quartz clusters on a stand. Yes, guys, smoky quartz clusters on a stand. Now, I've seen like really big points, double smoky points on stands, but to actually see like a full on cluster is insane. And a lot of these are double sided. So you're pretty much getting like two clusters in one. I have never in my life actually seen something like this. And that's why I had to pick this up for you guys because I just thought how breathtaking and how really cool because this is even something really amazing just to add as a display piece somewhere in your home like maybe your front entrance somewhere on a bookshelf this really is a really nice beautiful statement piece usually everything on a stand i feel is a really really nice statement piece but the fact that it has the clusterization on both sides is so amazing so some of them will have clusters on both sides some of them will have clusters on one side but nevertheless really really gorgeous like this one has the cluster on one side but you guys look at how insanely gorgeous this is so it is more of a raw back but you guys that cluster side oh my god i hope this video is doing it justice because it really is so, so stunning. Now again, these are all natural breaks. I promise you, <laughs> it's not that this has fallen or broken. These are all natural breaks, but nevertheless, really, really gorgeous. Smoky Quartz is really beautiful and just, oh, when I saw these on a stand, I just thought these are statement pieces. I really, really love it. Like if you block out the stand, can you see how big of a cluster that is? I mean, these are insane. These are not really small clusters. Before, when I had my last Brazilian haul, I had some really nice small smoky quartz clusters, but these are really, really huge and they are on a stand. So again, they are a statement piece, a really beautiful display piece. I just had to get those because I thought that was so unique. Again, it's been, I don't think I've ever seen something like that before in other shops. So when I saw this, I had to get it for you guys because I just thought, Oh my god, this is so unique, so beautiful, so perfect for some of you because I thought of some of you when I saw these pieces. I was like, oh, this person's really going to love this. So I had to get those because they really are just so unique and so gorgeous. And the next thing I want to show you guys is, as I mentioned, I did get some of those beautiful Monet Jasper Towers for you again. And you guys, just look at how beautiful that is. I love this mix of like brown and purple. It's honestly so gorgeous and i promise you guys the videos don't do it justice it's such a pretty kind of underrated jasper because i feel like you don't really see monet jasper around like that so when my supplier had these oh i had to stock up on these and i'm so glad that you guys enjoyed the first round of these that i had to get some more i really tried to get more of those really nice yellows browns but with really nice pink and purple inclusions in them because i know that's what you guys really liked i really like that also i really like the nice hints of pink and purples in them and then i also wanted to show you guys if you saw my personal haul i did mention these before these are green flower agates and i did get them in the shop and i am so excited to offer them to you guys now there has been a comment i did see someone say that these possibly could be dyed full disclosure to be honest i don't know i've been told and from other shops that have bought this that this is green flower agate that this is a thing 
But you know what? To be honest, I wouldn't be surprised if it's died. But that's the thing. That's why you don't uptick your prices to ridiculous amounts. So I am just pricing these at what I would price regular flower agate. Like I'm not going to price these because some people have told me they have paid astronomical figures for some of these green agates and then the thing is they possibly could be dyed we don't 100 percent know i don't think anyone has really gotten them tested but i have heard from a source there's just one person that did mention that they heard that these could be dyed now again you know that's the thing with the crystal community and when new things come out is like sometimes you really just don't know and people haven't done the research and people haven't tested it so mine i've chosen to just price at flower agate prices and not because of the commotion because it could be a real thing like green flower agate could be a thing but that's the thing it's not like super super rare you could find it it's really not that bad it is more expensive than regular flower agate but you know what it is what it is i'm not going to uptick my prices on it i try not to uptick my prices that much at all to begin with so i'm not going to uptick them just because they're green and people say they're rare and natural but then there are people who are saying it's dyed I'm just gonna price it at regular flower agate prices because that's what it is. It's just, it's flower agate. It just has a nice green tone to it. All right, so kind of done with that rant. The next thing I wanna show you guys, sorry, I kind of went off on a little tangent there, is I got these really beautiful, oh, you guys, these are so gorgeous. I actually ended up keeping two for myself because I was so obsessed. These really beautiful new finds from Brazil. This is Amazonite and Smoky Quartz spheres and you guys how gorgeous some of these even have lipidolite inclusions which i didn't know but you see that shine right there that kind of purple you guys that is lipidolite how freaking cool is that now not all of them but some of them do and you'll see like some of them have a smaller speck some of them have a little bit more lipidolite but how freaking cool is that? Because I thought it was just Amazonite and Smoky. But when I got to like, when I actually got these in person and got to really kind of study them and look at them, I noticed the mica inclusions. And I was like, dude, that's so cool. Like I kind of geeked out on that because I thought that was so cool. I was so excited to get these in because when I first saw it and I was like, oh my God, Amazonite and Smoky, what an amazing combo. But then when I noticed they had the lipidolite inclusions, you guys, I died and went to heaven. They are so, so stunning. I am so obsessed and I'm actually really, really happy that this was discovered because this wasn't a thing. This is like fairly new to the market. So that's really, really cool. And I'm so excited that I got those in the shop because they really are drop dead gorgeous, so much more better in person. And then I wanna show you guys, I also got some beautiful white aragonite and you guys, oh, who says, diamonds are a girl's best friend give me all of the white aragonite i mean what these are stunning let me try to make it a bit better for you guys so you can see there we go you guys look at how gorgeous these are oh my goodness these almost remind me like these ones right here remind me of like snow but also um like coral because you know how coral is coral is like super fragile there we go all right had to dim the light a bit so you guys can see it a little bit better but look at how beautiful and druzy these are this is white aragonite so so gorgeous it is kind of hard to show on camera because it is so druzy and so gorgeous i'm trying to find the best lighting but i really oh that's kind of like hard to do here let me see there we go. Try to turn it down, I guess, for you guys. See if that helps. I don't know if that really helps. I feel like that's made it worse. <laughs> it's kind of hard to find the lighting with this one, but I promise you they are really, really nice. Super, super druzy. They sparkle like crazy. But I will say I do want to put out a disclaimer with these is that they will have some fallout. So when you do get these delivered, they are super, super fragile. So they might have a little bit of like white fallout just from like, you know, again, it is a more fragile crystal. And again, it really is pretty much like coral. So it is difficult to kind of trans. These will be wrapped as best as I can. I will make sure that they get to you guys safely. But I just wanted to let you know that don't worry, there might be some fallout with these pieces. Again, because they are pretty fragile pieces. But I will, of course, be very careful when I package them and make sure like they are super 
like quadruply wrapped up that nothing happens to them. And then the last thing I want to show you guys is I ended up getting some more black tourmaline. Really, really gorgeous big pieces. A lot of them have some beautiful mica inclusions in them. Now black tourmaline, I cannot get enough of and I cannot tell you guys enough about it. It is such an amazing protective stone. I have these in any entrance and I would recommend in any entrance or exit of your home just to kind of ward off any bad energies, any bad intentions. A really, really amazing protection stone. So I would definitely recommend getting some black tourmaline if you don't have. And then also this is another crystal that in this form it is also pretty fragile so again you might see some fallout when you do get these in but do not worry that is okay that is normal let me show you guys do you see these little black specks right here so you will get some fallout but again that's just because that is natural to the crystal so do not worry and then again if anything does happen if it does break please reach out to me you know i will work with you guys to either get you a new piece or figure something out you know i'm not like that i'm not one to just be like oh sorry usps did it not my fault i will definitely work with you guys because i absolutely understand that these are more fragile crystals things can happen even when i package them to the best of my ability life happens <laughs> the post office happens unfortunately but but don't worry because i promise i've already shipped a few of these out and i've had no issues so i think there should be no problem but just how gorgeous are these so i did have black tourmaline in the shop before but i had really small pieces i want to say they were about this big some smaller some even thinner pieces so these are really nice bigger statement pieces that i got in and they're just oh they're so beautiful but of course i did get a few varieties Variety of sizes so there is that really really big extra large one then I got like these medium ones and I do still have the smaller ones up on the shop as well but these are just really beautiful really nice and high quality when you see that beautiful sheen and sparkle oh just so so gorgeous all right guys so that is all for today's haul i hope you guys really enjoyed i absolutely love doing hauls from brazil because they really have the most beautiful and unique items that you can find so i really hope you guys enjoyed thank you all for the support and the continued support you guys have been amazing since day one and i love each and every one of you please leave some comments down below if you have any questions concerns if there's things that you want to see that you haven't seen in my shop and as always till next time bye guys